name is Jim Self. Uh, I live in Hayden, Idaho. Best place to live in the United States. If you're a snowmobiler, a hunter, somebody that likes just to go out and hike, mountain bike, ski, you're, you're living right in the middle of it all. I did my research on steel hangers, pole barn hangers, and I realized after 20 years, a pole barn is absolutely worth nothing. And I started researching real hangers, steel hangers, buildings, and they increase in value if they're built correctly. They never lose their value if they're maintained and taken care of. They're a quality structure. The foundation on this building is unbelievable. There's 750 ton of steel in this floor, okay? Uh, I know because I tied ev all 5,000 ties and uh, it's uh, 15 inch on center and it's very thick floor. It's rated at 24,000 pounds per square inch. Uh, there's, it's 250 yard pour and that's not counting the 135 yards that's in the pilasters, grade beams and walls. This was the hoorah. And, and I wanted everything the way I wanted it because I requested the 412 pitch, I requested the 50 pound snow load, I requested a bunch of other stuff and um, they would accommodate me and when I went to uh, and the other places, they, wouldn't, they wanted to sell me what they had, they didn't want to give me what I wanted. And Great Western gave me what I wanted. And because steel prices hadn't come up, I got a great price. And they also suggested the door to me. It attaches to the building up at the top of the struts. And so you notice when you open it, the, the walls don't move, the front don't shake. Some of those pole barns with those bifolds, you open those doors and that whole building shakes. Scott Hansen, he's a roofer, he helped me. The head engineer at Great Western helped me a lot. When I needed a question answered, he answered it. We worked together pretty good. I appreciate the suggestion on high power doors and the guys at High Power too. It's the best door for an aircraft hangar in the world. And if I ever build another building, another hangar, which I might, I'm calling Great Western because they gave me what I wanted.